I've always believed the stories were real. It's said the Nova's crew refused to live above ground. And you think that city is out here in the jungle? I'm hopeful, and frankly, quite excited. Any information we could use against Mordremoth would be beneficial at this point. Where'd the green one disappear to? Kanak went on ahead. I think he may have needed to be alone for a moment. Kanak, are you...? I was just exploring. Nothing to get your staff all bent out of shape over. Commander, there's a packed lieutenant down there who is eager to talk to you. She and a few others managed to escape one of the Mordrum prisoner caravans. They set up a makeshift camp, but something's wrong. Lieutenant, you wanted to speak to me? Commander, Mordrum assaulted us the moment we hit the ground. The survivors were taken prisoner. You managed to escape? Yes. Marshal Traherne, Zoja, and Captain Thackeray created a diversion, so a few of us could escape. You were with them. Are they here? I'm afraid not. They sacrificed their own chance at freedom so we could get away. The Mordrum took them. Which direction did they go? I was too out of it. Our Magister would know. He was the last to escape, but he's not here. We have to find him. Where is he? A monster's been attacking the camp. It's picking us off a couple at a time. The Magister led a group after it to kill it, through the mushroom-lit passage there. Lieutenant, I'll leave some of my people here to protect you. I'll go after the Magister. Bram, you're with me. Commander, are you okay? You, uh, stumbled a bit there. It was nothing. Let's keep going. Commander, are you okay? You, uh, stumbled a bit there. It was nothing. Let's keep going. Looks like they didn't make it. I don't see anyone with Magister armor among the bodies, though. He must have gone deeper in. We need to find him. Preferably alive. Something's not right. If this is a Mordrum, then it's like nothing I've ever seen. Whatever it is, it's big. Looks like there are three ways forward. Which one do we take? Commander! You came for me? We're going to get you out of here. No. Raven is already here for me. Easy. I'm here. Can you tell me which direction the Maldrum caravan was going? I... yes. Into the jungle, heading deeper into Maldrum territory. Due... south. <sighs> Rest in peace, Great Hunter. I will personally spread your tale. The Itzel said the jungle provides... But it seems to provide only death. But we provide vengeance. Uh, you need to see this. There must be hundreds of them. We're not wading into that. We need to get back to our mission. <laughs> Guys, what are you doing here? Some more pack soldiers showed up and secured the camp. We came as quickly as we could. What did we miss? A giant bug thing. Anything on our friends? I spoke to the Magister before he died. He told me the caravan was headed south. Then we should go after them. 
I admit it's a hard choice, and I'm all for saving them too, but we can't just abandon the trip to Radanovas. The Novan scientists and their research on Elder Dragons could prove invaluable. We're going to have to split up. Taimi, Kanak, and I will go to Ratanovis. The rest of you scout for signs of the caravan. Rox, leave Marcus for us, and we'll catch up. Uh-uh. If this Rata has a dragon kill switch, I'm going with you. The others can scout the caravan. All right. Move out, everyone. Tislak! Well, hello. What brings you through this way? I'm looking for Rata Novis. Ever heard of it? Rata... Hmm. That doesn't sound promising. I'm assuming you mean an old Asurin city? Yes, near here. Underground. The Nuhak don't call that Rata Novis. We only know it as a forbidden pit of despair. That really doesn't sound promising. The city has been dead for generations. Only the bravest venture in now. Disappointing news, but I'd still like to check it out. In that case, I can get you a map of the easiest way in. That sounds great. Thanks. The easiest way is still fraught with peril. Of course it is. It's also blocked by a chuck hive. You'll need to dissolve it in order to enter Ratanovis. But don't fret. We Nuhawk have a solution for that, in both senses of the word. You see, the jungle has an answer for every question it poses. In this case, the answer is alchemy. I can craft you this solvent, but it requires chuck enzyme. Bring enough back here and you'll have your key to the city. I will. Where can I find the enzyme? You can harvest them from the chuck themselves. That route will certainly go faster, if you know the ways of our hunters. Or you might find other Nuhawk in the village who are willing to part with theirs. Got it. Thanks, Tislak. I have all the other ingredients. Still need the right amount of enzyme. I'm on it. We should get moving. Where's Timey? I told her not to, but she wandered off to study some old text she said looked fantastically intriguing. Time is of the essence, but we can't leave her here alone. Wait, guys! I'm here! Don't get your feathers in such a ruffle! I'm fine! Well, we don't have time to wait here while you play with some new toys. A dragon's not just gonna sit around while we find this Rodanovan research. It's okay. But we can't delay any longer. Tislak was right. The city appears long dead. I guess we won't find any allies to rally for our cause. Maybe no new allies, but there is something else here. Picking up some prints that are definitely not a sword. Looks like they belong to... Chalk? Yeah, how did you... Ah, gotcha. Makes sense the Chalk are here. This place is a nexus for lay energy. I speculate these things actually channel it somehow. Great. Well-fed shock. They're probably responsible for the death of this entire city. Luckily, you can withdraw into the safety of your golem. This is obviously no place for an Asura. Safety of my golem? What's that supposed to mean? 
Maybe you need the safety of my golem. What? I'm not saying it. Nature is. Okay, enough. Let's pick up the pace. We need to find the lab where they conducted their dragon research. What's the best way to do that? Maybe if we power up the city, Scruffy could trace the biggest energy drop. Logically, it should be the hub of their research. Sounds reasonable. How do you restore power to this place? That's what I was investigating before you got here, not playing with toys, Bram. Anyway, they had a different procedure for refining lay energy and using it for power. Impressive. This thing's an offline lay collector. We could manually turn enough of them on to get the juice flowing, but the chalk will notice and come running. It's worth the risk. Get it started. Cannot, is it just me, or is the cold quieted down here? I noted that as well. Mordremoth's voice was growing to a great bellow as we drew closer. Here it's a whisper. It's a welcome respite. Was it becoming too much for you? Was it for you? No. My resolve is stronger than that. Mine as well. The Chalk's connection to Ley Energy is curious. I wonder if it could be employed against Mordremoth. Going after the Rodanovan research is one thing. We can't waste time studying them now. Ram, no one has ever wasted time studying. Let's stay on course. Which way, Timey? Now that we started the engine, I'm getting a sizable power signature. Might be a lab. Follow me and the big guy. How's it working now, Tiny? We're back on track. Think so. We're almost right on top of the source. Is that? An Asura gate? Similar in design, but probably similar in function. Is it active? Why isn't it glowing if we turned on the power? Good question. Uh, let me see. Um, okay. Good news, bad news. Good news is there's enough power to turn this gate on. Bad news is something's interrupting the flow. Something big. I think we found the culprit. Nice job, Timey. Thanks! But Scruffy did most of the work. Yeah, well, he's as much part of the team as you. I guess so. Sure. The gates up. Where do you think it goes? Run soon? As far as I know, they were never connected. It must lead deeper into this complex. We should test it out. Make sure it's safe. How do we do that? Someone just walks into it, and if they're not obliterated, it works. Who wants to try? I suppose I'll try it. Great job not done, Commander! I told you that gate would... No 
everyone was planning on going back that way. Where'd we end up? There's a huge lay draw ahead of us. I bet my transverse wave inverter, it's the Dragon Lab. Wolf's Fang. We seem to be outnumbered. This isn't a lab to them. It's a dragon. Wait, the emblem on that blast door. A dragon! That must be it! We need to get through that mess and open that lab. We can't. The door that leads down those stairs is dead. So we're trapped here? The only other way out was through the gate that just exploded? Maybe? Probably. <laughs> yes. Is there any way to get the doors working again? Oh! Hold on! Lay energy powers this whole place, and this lay conduit is blown. It almost certainly rendered the doors to this room and the lab inoperative when it went. If we can complete the circuit, they'll both open for sure. Any ideas, people? I have a thought. Scruffy can bridge the gap. The lay tech I outfitted him with should conduct the energy. But... will he survive? Well, I'm not sure. Timey, back at Dry Top where the inquest destroyed Scruffy and almost captured you. Come. You can't what? Let a child make her own decisions? I'm not a child, and this is what I'm doing. Maybe I wasn't ready for it at Dry Top, but I'm ready now. Fair enough. But once the doors are open, we'll still have a ton of chuck to contend with. I have an idea for that too, but first things first. All right, big guy. It's time. You know what to do. Why did he stop? Go on. It's okay. I'll be okay. Thank you, Timmy. Now about those chalk. Yes, we're devastatingly outnumbered. Commander, when you were young, do you remember the bad kids burning beetles with a magnifying lens? I've heard stories. Why? Because I'm about to be bad. The device in that room is basically a huge telescope. I can reconfigure all the lights in there to feed into the lenses, turning it into a giant heat ray. Then we have ourselves a chalk cookout. Brilliant. Do what you need to. We'll back you up. Okay. Here we go. Come on! Almost there! Commander! Now what? Over here, Commander! Arm over this way! Draw the chalk into the path of my beam! Yes? That... was amazing. It smells better than I would have imagined, too.
Is this it? Is this the right place? Boot up these machines and we'll find out. Novans had a serious beef against Primordus. Anything on Moldromoth? No. Well, sort of. It's about all the Elder Dragons. What is it? Based on their extensive research on Primordus, the Rada Novans determined that each Elder Dragon had a weakness. A unique, respective weakness. And does it say... What it is? No. How easily the fleet went down. It's obvious the way you and my mother stopped Zaitan won't work here. So what do we do now? This is good news, people. We've been charging headlong against Mordromoth, not even knowing if it can be beaten, only knowing we had to beat it. Now we know it's possible. Our mission is to find out how. To do that, we have to get closer to Mordromoth. And thanks to that lay map, we know exactly where it is. Let's catch up with the others, then. I suppose it'd be nice to have some help finding this weakness. Thanks for everything, Timey. So, does this mean no more Scruffy? Oh, no. I already have design plans for Scruffy 2.0. Little trim here, a little tuck there, and weapons, lots of weapons. But no golem for the immediate future means this is the end of the road for me. I'll be staying in Rada Novus with all this delectable research. Bummer! Alone? Are you sure? Hey, would you ask Ritlock if he was sure? To not? Point taken. Should I send word to someone back at Rada soon? Let them know you're here. Uh, no thanks. I'll take care of that. In, like, a few weeks or so. Don't want to get flunted again, huh? Not particularly. <laughs> okay, Timey. I hope to see you soon. Me too, Commander. Give that dragon a good one for me. Rox was here. His marks are no question. You die! Someone or something came through after. I still think that's one of Rox's signs. Motoma! Failed you! These tracks look fresh. I must be getting close. <laughs> <laughs> 